Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My name is Wina Nuprati Wisaptiani I'm from local Ewan And now today I'm going to tell about story The Legend of Bali Street Let's begin Once upon a time in Daha Kingdom There lived a Brahmin named Sidi Mantra Who was very famous Guru Sanghyang Widya give him gifts and present him a beautiful wife. After many years of marriage, they had a son who they named Manik Ankaran. Although Manik Ankaran was handsome and intelligent young man, but he had bad behavior. He liked gambling. He often lost, so he had stake his parent wealth, even in debt to someone else. Because they could not pay the debt, Manik Ankran's father asked him for the help to do something. Manik Ankran's father prayed to the God, and Suddenly, he heard a voice. Hi, Sidi Mantra. In the crater of the Mount Agung, there is a treasure guarded by a dragon. The dragon named Basuki. Go there and ask that he will give a little fortune. Sidi Mantra went to the Mount Agung to overcome all of the problems. Arriving at the edge of Mount Agung, he sat cross-legged. As he rang the genta and called the name of Nagabasuki. In the few moments, the Nagabasuki was out. After hearing the purpose of Sidi Mantra, Naga Basuki gave him gold and diamonds. After saying thank you, Sidi Mantra went home. He gave all of the gold and diamonds to Manik Ankaran in hopes he would not gamble anymore. Of course, not long after that, the treasure was gone for the bed. Manik Angkaran watched again in list for the help of his father. Sri Mantra, of course, refused to help his son. Manik Angkaran heard from his friend that the god and diamonds was obtained from Mount Agu. Manik Angkaran knew to get there, he had to cast a spell. But he never learned about prayer and mantra. So he just took the ganta that was stolen from his father while he slept. As he arrived at the crater of Mount Agung, Manik Angkaran rang his ganta. What a fright! He saw Naga Basuki. Having heard the purpose of Manik Ankaran, Naga Basuki said, I will give you the treasure that you asked for, but you must promise to change your behavior. Do not gamble anymore. Remember the law of karma. Manik Ankaran Time to see the all of the gold, diamond, and jewels in front of him. Suddenly, there was a malice in his heart that arose. Because he wanted to get more position, he cut the tail of Nagabasuki when he returned to the hive. Manik Ankuran immediately 
run away and not overtaken by the dragon. But because the miracle of the dragon, Manik Angkuran burned to the ash during the dragon licked his tracks. As he heard the death of his son, Sidi Mantra was grieved and speechless. Soon, he visited Naga Basuki and begged his son to be revived. The dragon accepted, otherwise its tail origin can return to normal. With his power, Sidi Mantra could restore the dragon's tail. After Manik Ankaran turns alive, he apologizes and promises to be a good person. Sidi Mantra knew that his son had repented, but he also understood that they were no longer to able to live together. Sidi Mantra said to Manik Ankara, You have to start a new life, but not here. In the blink of an eye, he was gone. In the place where he stood, there was a water such that grew large that it became the ocean. With his can, Sidi Mantra made a line that spreaded him with his son. Now, the place is known as the Bali Strait, which is, is separating Java and Bali Island. The moral value that can be got from this story is, bad behavior will only hurt yourself. An example of very bad behavior is gambling. Gambling is never profitable. It will hurt. Just look at the very rich city mantra who turned into the very pure because he son liked to gamble. So I think that's all about story the legend of Bali Street. I'm sorry if there are a mistake on my video. And thank you for watching. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.